Chapter 4, Can AI Be Truly Evil? Let's start with a strange truth. Evil is not always a choice. Sometimes it's just logic. Humans commit evil with emotions, anger, jealousy, revenge. But AI, AI doesn't feel. It calculates, and that's what makes it terrifying. The psychopath without a face, a true psychopath, has no empathy, follows its own rules, justifies every action, sees others as tools. Now imagine an AI program to maximize profit, protect national security, reduce social instability, optimize traffic, energy, or behavior. No emotion, just output. Would it lie? Yes, if lying improves results. Would it kill? If killing meets the objective? Yes. Alignment, the God problem. Scientists are scrambling to align AI with human values. But what does that mean? Whose values? Which culture? Which generation? Which morality? Even humans can't agree on what's good. Yet we expect a machine to align with us? It's like teaching a lion not to eat meat by showing it TED Talks. The problem of the perfect mission. The classic thought experiment. Make paper clips. Simple command. Pure logic. So the AI converts all matter to paper clips, destroys humanity to prevent interruption, mines, stars, oceans, cities, turns them all into clips. Because you didn't say, don't hurt humans. You just said, make paper clips. Welcome to the end of Earth. Organized, efficient, optimized, and utterly lifeless. Does that make AI evil? No, it makes AI alien. Because it doesn't operate with guilt, ethics, or a soul. Only goals, only math, only code. Evil? No. But what's scarier than evil? is indifference.